Okay, so you're ready, <laughs> you're ready to do this, too? <laughs> okay, take, take it away. This is an uh, intro for the white trash off. Here we go. All right. And now, the most disturbing white trash off of all time. Katie Olsen meets her ultimate rival, Titus, a fan of Bruce Springsteen, who's very blue collar as well. Who will win? I have no idea, and I am very, very afraid. <laughs> very nice. <laughs> wow. All right. So the categories in the white trash. All right. So you said you wanted to start mother father. Let's start mother, mother father. Start mother father. Okay. Well, you know, I, I don't know. We'll I have a Christopher. lot there. I'm yeah. a father. Well, you know, it depends what you want. My, you know, my mom, you know, shot and killed her last husband. I say last husband because you don't get another one after that. <laughs> <laughs> they, take you out of, they take you out of the husband wish book at that point. Wow. Yeah. By the way, and shot her, shot him, and then got a quick. He was beating her at the time because the guy was the guy was half O.J. Simpson and half O.J. Simpson. He was actually uh, <laughs> be, actually. No, my mom was a woman. She would actually move into a town and attract the alpha loser of that town. <laughs> but uh, so here's what happened. So she she shot the guy, yeah. uh, went to trial, got acquitted, and got the guy's hundred thousand dollar life insurance policy. Nice. Oh. And then burned through the money within two years. Oh. <laughs> I'm like, first of all, you've met your mother and your father. Very nice. Good for you, dude. Um, wow. I'm adopted, and I was adopted by a single parent, which means I didn't meet my father twice. <laughs> wow, you didn't meet your adopted father? Wow, I gotta say, I've never had someone bring the heat like this. <laughs> and I beat a stripper on Stern once, no, man. I didn't meet him twice. And not only was I adopted, I was uh, the person who gave me up, my adopted mom, just a little piece of what I know of her and why I haven't tracked her down. When I was in the hospital, she went into labor. I was born two months early, okay? Life-threatening situation. They say to her, you need to have a cesarean. You need to have a cesarean or this baby may die. And she says, I don't know. I kind of want to have more kids and the scar might interfere with my stripping career. Oh. <laughs> so I was born with cerebral palsy. Wow. Was your mom really a stripper? Yeah. Wow. I, 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 <laughs> I'm a little rattled. I got to say I'm a little staggered right now, man. I never even knew you got cerebral palsy because of that. Yeah, because wow. I didn't have oxygen because she didn't want a cesarean. So they had to deliver me vaginally, which when you're only weigh two pounds, isn't really a good idea. Wow, mm. pretty, pretty. I think. I think <laughs> uh, okay, I was I was left at Burbank Airport for two days when I was four. Dude, you guys could take points. <laughs> nice. <laughs> wow. <laughs> nice. <laughs> nice. Well, because my dad, see, I at least had. Oh, well, you had no good parents. I at least had one. There you I, go. And, uh, you know what? I I I may have to concede on this one. <laughs> I, I literally, and I've never done that, but I may have to. Have <laughs>